it's your girl not a brat but you know that i'm back at it again with another video if you're returning subscribe what's popping what's popping and if you're new become a brat and that's that okay miss girl so we are back at it with the entrepreneur series i decided to start over um and really just take you guys through the process of um me rebranding brat's way and for those of you, for those of you that are new if you don't know brat's way is my uh lash brand um, as I've stated before in previous videos, we are currently um, under reconstruction. So we are going through a mini rebrand and branching off into cosmetics. And I'm so fucking excited because I just, I just, I'm loving this new chapter that we're approaching. Um, and Brad's Way actually turns two in a few weeks. Um, I believe it's next week. If I'm not mistaken, June seventeenth of twenty twenty is the day that I started my business. I'll never forget that day, um, and I'm excited. So, um, without further ado, let me explain to y'all how I went about having this flash sale and what went down, my mistakes, all that good stuff. So, the first things first. So, the other day I was just in my room, um, and I was on the phone with a friend, and we were just talking about, you know how we're, you know, making money and what type of money we want to make and shit like that. So after we got off the phone, I'm like, hmm, well, I've been sitting on lash inventory since November and y'all didn't know this because um, when I purchased my inventory um, this past time, I was extremely depressed. So there were no entrepreneur videos of, you know, how much I spent on inventory, what I got as far as inventory was concerned and things like that. Um, I kind of just like promoted it at first and then, you know, depression kicked in and I never really promoted it like that after. Um, and that's, that's what sucks about depression. Depression really sucks the fun and the love out of everything. Y'all know I love my business. Like my business, Brat's Way is my freaking baby. I would do anything for my baby, but you know, um, mama was sad. Okay. Mama was sad. So there was nothing that I could really do. Um, and I honestly was just tired of sitting on lashes. So I was like, you know what? Let's have a flash sale, but let's make the lashes dirt cheap. Um, so I can get them off my hands and, you know, I can start fresh with new inventory and things like that. So, um, I randomly decided to have a flash sale. Um, I can't remember if it was, I think it was last Thursday. <clears throat> it was last Thursday. And I marked all my lashes down from $15 to a dollar, um, but they had to pay $3 still for shipping. So I could still, you know, make a little profit. When I tell y'all, I literally posted it on, I believe that I posted on Instagram first. I posted it on Facebook first. Then I posted it on my business page, um, Bratsway. <laughs> Excuse me. And click the link down below to keep up with Bratsway down below in the comments. I mean, I keep saying the comments in the description box. I have all of our social medias, the TikTok, the Insta. Go follow that, okay, per. Um, and I also have some. We'll we'll get to that. Um, so I started to promote it, and then you know I got two orders. So I was like, oh, okay, like this regular girl. The orders start coming in. I went on TikTok, and something was like, girl, you always go on TikTok to talk about your lashes and your business. You might as well. So I went on TikTok live and as y'all know, your girl is virally famous over there, okay? Um, we didn't got noticed by Nicki Minaj this year. We didn't got noticed by Drake, Naja Charles. Listen, your girl out here doing big things you just haven't heard because I haven't been around and I have been depressed. But, you know, <laughs> I love having TikTok because TikTok you can really like go crazy with your small business. Um, and I don't even consider Brats Way small. Like, yeah, I'm still operating on a small scale, but in my eyes, it's nothing small about it. Simple. So I went live. I showed the girls, you know, what they wanted to see. And mind you, I had on lash extensions at the time. Um, so it was kind of hard to promote them, but I was still able to, you know, score them sales, boo. And it actually made it even better that I had on lash extensions because, um, the most, the majority of the lashes that I sell for Brat's Way, they have that lash extension look and feel. So it was worth it in the end. Um, so many girls just started purchasing. Like, and I low-key should have had a limit on how many you could purchase um, because my inventory was a little limited. Um, but 
nonetheless i'm not mad at it um so let's just get into the mistakes that i made um i had no plan let's start there um i just randomly did this um <clears throat> just because you know i was tired of looking at my inventory whenever you have a sale you need to have a plan because you want to make sure that you make enough to invest back into your business and pay yourself um and also you just want to make sure that you follow everything um according to plan you know i don't like plan i don't i don't like not having a plan and the saying goes if you don't plan you plan to fail now this sale wasn't a fail but i definitely could have um planned it so it could have turned out a little bit better but you know now i know for next time that i need to plan <laughs> um another mistake i feel like i made was the inventory so i had a set amount of inventory on my site only because like you know over time um i just make my numbers smaller um what i mean by that is so like say i put um in the back office that there's 50 lashes and i've sold like 10 of those you get what i'm saying um i kind of did it like that because you know when i had lashes before um i would just deduct it just so like it wouldn't make it seem like it sold out easily basically is what i'm trying to say so um another mistake basically would be like not having the proper inventory count now i do believe i have enough lashes for everybody that did order um but i'm just a little scared that i might have to refund somebody um and that's not a problem but you know now i know for next time make sure you know how much inventory you have on hand exactly post it in the back office of shopify let whatever sells and what's not you just that's what you got left and that just help also helps me um because i can see like how long it took for this this and this to sell um it just makes everything better when you track everything so the mistakes that i made with this sale was not having a plan and not keeping track of my inventory but what I also loved about when I did have the sale, as soon as I got like another couple orders, I had just like stopped it um, because at this point, I just felt like I didn't have enough inventory, physical inventory for the lashes that I have on hand. So I was like, you know what? Let's stop the sale. I'm glad the sale did great, but I just can't risk any more orders coming through. Um, that I And yeah, so there's that. Um, I had also added 3D lashes that I have been sitting on for like a year or two um, to my website as well. The girls start eating it up, start, and start to buy those. And now I'm excited because Bratsway is going to offer 3D mink lashes. And for to see that a lot of girls like the lashes, girl, it's only right. It's only right that we bring them back. So I would definitely be bringing those back. A lot of the girls bought all of those pairs. Like my friend Danielle, hey bitch, if you're watching this, she bought like five, seven pairs of the 3D Mink lashes, which I freaking appreciate. Um, I still have 3D Mink lashes available on my site, available for purchase, and I will ship them to you. They are a dollar still. Um, you can read the description box, um, the description box for my website and stuff like that um, at www.brightsway.com per. Um, what else am i missing um i feel like that's that like you know um and i did make over over a hundred dollars i'll post it somewhere here on the screen and um overall though for that month for my business i did make like close to a thousand dollars including the sale which i love because you know your girls out here doing big things with promo and stuff like that and i don't have time to be putting all that stuff on a separate site and i'm also still developing my personal brand so when people want to purchase promo from me they can purchase it off bratsway.com um it just makes everything easier for me so i can keep track of it as well um but yes like i me having that sale said a lot it showed the influence that i have over my own business which also means that i need to start showing up and it's very, 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 very important for you to show up for your business, no matter if you're sad, depressed. Um, you just really got to fake it till you make it. Because at the end of the day, with your feelings on the table, money still has to get made. And one of my favorite entrepreneurs, the Diddy Des, and I feel like I'm always talking about her. One of the things that I love that she says is there's no feelings in business. And it's true because the moment that you get your feelings involved in your business, it, it it everything it it turns to a shit show and we can't have that so you know you gotta really learn how to separate your emotions from your business because 
your business is not going to grow with you being emotional all the time. Now, there are instances where, you know, you are going to get emotional because entrepreneurship is hard. Like, it's not easy. I'm only two years in this um, and I've definitely done a great job, but I know for a fact that I could do better, which is why we are doing better and we're working towards being better. Um, and that's exactly why I needed to make this video for you guys, because you know, your girl don't sugarcoat and not a goddamn thing. Um, but yeah, your girl had a successful flash sale, um, excuse me, or sale period. Um, I feel like this is probably another successful sale that I've had. Um, and it just makes me excited for what's to come. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it, y'all. I didn't want to make this video too long and not too short. I wanted to give you guys enough information just to, you know, let you know. What's well, tea with the entrepreneur stuff? The entrepreneur videos are back in here to stay for the summer. I promise. Um, I'm definitely going to be rolling these videos out weekly as we speak. So be on the lookout for that. Um, on my orders, I'm actually about to package right now because we have some issues, like I said, and next time we know that we can prevent these issues from happening by having a plan and properly keeping track of inventory. So with that being said, I love you guys so much. Make sure y'all follow me on all my social media, Instagram, TikTok, at neither brat, cause you know your girl's TikTok famous or whatever. And I will see y'all in my next video. So this is what we got right here, the madness of Brad's way right now. These are all the orders that are going out today. And this order is special because it is a pickup order. My girl Ashley ordered literally over 25 pairs of lashes. Ashley, for watching this, thank you so much for shopping. You did not have to shop with me. Um, this, this is my biggest order I've ever gotten at once. <laughs> um, so if you know you're feeling discouraged today let this be your sign that you keep going with your business because it's not small forever okay Her. and here are all the orders i'm literally just missing one um i'm still waiting on my girl to come pick up her 25 pairs the stop playing but i love y'all so fucking much like i could cry but i don't have time to cry because i gotta get y'all orders to the post office I love you guys so, so freaking much. Thank you so much for supporting my business. It's the Brad Sway or no motherfucking way. Like, look at how, and I would never forget, two years ago, I literally only got two orders on the first day of Brad Sway opening. And now look, this might not be a lot to some, but this is major as fuck to me. I love you guys so much, and I will definitely see y'all in my next video. Stop playing. My brand Bradsway will turn two years old next week, right? And I literally just had a flash sale. Y'all saw me out. I literally have four pairs of lashes left. I don't, I don't know what to say. I'm literally on my way to the post office right now. Thank y'all so much for shopping because y'all did not have to shop. Let me show y'all. Cause yeah, it's the Bradsway or no way. Stop playing. Don't ever play with the brand. I don't want to show y'all too much because everybody's. Uh, look at Dior. Stop. Stop. Look at, look at all that. Look at that. Bag on full. All my bitches finna be bad with my lashes. Stop playing. The restock is coming soon. I'm coming crazy. I'm coming crazy. But in the meantime, I do have 3D mink lashes left on the site available for purchase. They are still a dollar. So yeah, go get you some. I might as well take y'all to the post office with me, shouldn't I? Come on. I'm sorry, I didn't record. I was in the post office, but here y'all go. All y'all orders have been shipped. Stop playing. Keep shopping with me. I love y'all so, 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 so fucking much. I love y'all so much.